Hi brother, this is Novella from Victoria. How is everything over there? Everything over here is fine. Did you have a Merry Christmas? We have a big family reunion over here. Well, everybody's doing fine over here. Bye for now. Hello, Buck. <laughs> What's happening? Well, this is one of the William Bars down here from Victoria, Texas. I've never been inside town, but I'd like to get there. Uh, my name is Will. I guess you're wondering which one. That's Fred. <laughs> Alf is homesick. Sick, sick boy. He went out last night, and I mean, <laughs> I mean, he went out and he, 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 he yeah. <laughs> I'll tell you like it is. Uh, what's been happening over there? How's uh, where, where's the station? Vietnam. I hear you stationed in Vietnam. How's the Viet? Oh, man. Uh, how's uh, VidCons? <laughs> I hope they're not fighting you now. Uh, yeah. Uh, things down here are running pretty smooth. Pretty smooth. Pretty smooth. <laughs> yeah. We got we got all the family over here. We have in Ruby over here. I think she have a wig on tonight. Uh, and I think Mama Mama got her wig on. Uh, don't feel bad. <laughs> I think she got a false tooth. Uh, both of them got false teeth. <laughs> yeah. Uh huh, and uh, Lois Dean's around here somewhere, and uh, yeah. and uh, ain't Diamonds here? Everybody's here, and uh, and uh, Miles hit me in the head now. <laughs> I'll tell you like it is. Uh, well, uh, it's nice talking to you, and sometimes write me a letter, you know, and uh, and, uh, and uh, that's like the rules about talking here. <laughs> yeah, man, we had turkey. <laughs> yeah, we had turkey, and we had dressing, we had just about everything. Oh, okay, I better sign off now. So, when you turn yeah, that on, it's all right. Go. Talk into it. Oh, yeah. Huh? Yeah. Go back Yeah. Go. Well, I'm talking. <laughs> Hello, brother. How you doing? <laughs> you can, you, I can't handle <laughs> it. <laughs> brother? Hello, this is A. Homer. I'm doing pretty good. Oh, um, uh, well, you come on talk <laughs> Brother, we had a nice time. We had dinner with Aunt Rose today. And we wished you would be here, but you're not here. We pray for you. You pray for me, and I'll pray for you. Pretty hard for me today, but I'm still fighting on. Fighting on. I, I, I pray for you every night for, for you to make yeah, yeah. Uh, now you be sweet. Yeah. Tell, <laughs> tell us, see ya. So, hey, brother, how you doing? There? <laughs> hey, what are you doing? Your <laughs> uncle Boston, huh? I got me a big deal. I'm waiting for you to come in home. I'm going to give you a lot of dinner sausage. Huh? No, I can't hear it. Hi, brother. This is your daddy. I wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. I received all your Christmas cards and all. We all had dinner down here at Aunt Rose's. We were down there having fun. I guess that's where you hear all the noise in the background. But we hope next year that you'll be here. And you couldn't be here this year. We're sorry. But next year we know that probably you'll be here. And you, Daddy, playing it cool, he didn't go to Corpus this year because... He, he was in Corpus, he came home this morning, but I'll see you Christmas, so goodbye. Well, yeah. Mr. Yeah. Yeah. Brother, this is Uncle Lucy, from the, uh, the banks of the Godlow River. <laughs> I want to let you know that we are down here having a great time down on Garfield Street this afternoon. Man, we got people here, here below. Everybody got plenty of turkey, pie, cake, and cookies. Boy, you're talking about a beautiful life that we are living in. We're praying for you that you'll make it home one day after a while. It's a lot of, it's a lot of beauty in life, and we are searching for beauty. And ain't love is going on. We all going to get together. We're going to sing your Christmas carol. So we love it. What we going to sing? Silent night. Okay, everybody join in with a silent night. 
Silent night. No, okay, come on. Come on, you sing it. Okay, no, no, no. I'm a little hard. Cry, everybody. Silent night. Holy night. This is a lovey. <laughs> Say, look here, Mr. Brother. I hope you enjoyed that wonderful number understand coming from the Garfield Street in Victoria, Texas. I'm going to turn it over to somebody else. Yeah. Okay. Hi, brother. I received your card. I guess you think I forgot you. I haven't wrote you in a long time, but I'm still praying for you. And we're praying for you and hope you have a Merry Christmas. And we miss you a lot, but uh, we know you ca you can't be with us, but we're praying when we can see the time when we can see you. Bye. Well, okay, so hello, brother. Thank you for the pretty birthday card. I received your Christmas card. Hey, Ricky. Uh, wish you was here today. I looked for you on TV this morning when they had all all the boys from Vietnam on there. Well, that's all I have to say. Hello. Okay. Come say hello, brother. Hello, brother. This is Randy. This is Randy. There you go. That's <laughs> nice. So this is Robert Jr. This is Robert Jr. There you go. Say hello, brother. Say hello, brother. That's it. <laughs> hello, this is you, lady speaking. <laughs> Mr. Brother, while we're waiting on the rest of the group to get together, uh, I want to let you know that uh, uh, I'm thinking about uh, getting ready and we are going to Schrader, Texas this afternoon. We're expecting to have a big time over in Schrader, Texas. Uh, we are, uh, me and Uncle Son, we're looking for nothing but beauty. Uh, you know what that beauty is? We're looking for something in our pocket, man. I'm telling you, I'm telling you. Uh, I'm waiting on Robin and uh, Lois Dean to come through. Yeah. Say, brother, man, you know what done happened, man? I know you don't know. You know I done made Grandpa, man. <laughs> Mr. Brother, I'm the master ceremony of the rest of the crew. We have at this moment the great sensational way of uh, 111 Griffin Drive, Mrs. Lois Dean, Lois Dean Franklin. Come here at this one moment. She's the lady on the air. Take over, Lois Dean Franklin. Yes, tell them what you got to say. Let's go and talk. Now, go ahead. <laughs> yeah. uh, hello, hello, brother. This is Lois Steen. Um, I wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. And um, I'll be looking forward to you coming home in, in the April. future. <laughs> Cut it off. At this moment, we have Bert. Uh, Mr. Who is your name? Randy? Randy. This is Mr. Randy. Do you have a word to say? Say hello, brother. Hi, brother. This is Mr. Randy. Mr. Randy. I hope you a Merry Christmas. I wish you a Merry Christmas. And a Happy New Year. I wish you a Happy New Year. Yeah. Hello, brother. This is Faye. I hope you had a very Merry Christmas. And I hope you have a Happy New Year. I receive, I receive your, uh, I'm in Victoria now. I receive your uh, Christmas gift. And I really like it. Andrea is big and still getting around, just like one year old, although she is just five months. 
my brother. I have one of the greatest stars down here on Garfield Street, Mrs. Rhea, uh, Mother Mrs. Faye. She got something to say and she's looking so happy today. She just come from Dallas and she's down in Victoria to spend the Christmas. Oh, I want you to say something, Rhea. Say, hey. Say, hey, Uncle Brother. Say, what you know, man? What you know? Yeah, she want to let you know she's doing fine. She's looking well. Yeah, I've got the next one coming on. I'm trying to get them together here. Mr. Brother, we have one of the greatest stars that came in here on Garfield Street. This house is getting to get bigger and bigger. Uh, we have Mrs. Lula. Uh, uh, Edwards. They just dropped in. She got a word that she want to say to you. Hi, Lula. It's already on. Oh, hello, brother. This is Lula. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Brother, I'm coming back. <laughs> With the lady. Have spread it wide. And have did well. It's a lady that have kept the faith and the children have grown up. She's sitting back, back now with a great smile on her face. And that's my sister-in-law, Miss A. Ruby. She's looking cool this afternoon. And uh, she's a great sister-in-law of mine. Uh, I don't know, every time we see one another, we always have a lot to talk about, but even one thing, she's a big, great, big bingo lady. She goes seven days a week. She don't give nobody else a chance. And at this time, I'm going to introduce you to Miss Mrs. Ruby Gibson. At this moment, come ahead, eh, Ruby? Hello, brother. How are you doing? <laughs> I, uh, Merry Christmas to you and I hope I know now. Thank God. And uh, this, I'm going to sing you a little song. Silent night, holy night, all is gold, is Uh, brother, I hope you enjoyed that wonderful number from Ain Ruby. I think she's giving Ain Love a great competition now. I'm going to tell you, she's, she's on the top of the hill. She's sailing now. At this moment, we're going to introduce the great uh, Uncle Rufus Johnson on Garfield Street at this moment. Hello, brother. How you doing? Uncle Rufus got the floor here. <laughs> <laughs> <I know. laughs> he won't give nobody else time to say nothing. <laughs> so I guess I can't say very much. But with you him, we could be going back to Houston again. <laughs> See that stroll. <laughs> Goodbye. See you later. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Brother. Brother. What happened to the Dallas? What happened to Don Merritt on Sunday? It time he. Throwed his arm back. They was in the septic. What happened to him now? He was in bad shape Sunday. They had to go get Craig Martin. Else it would have been a bad deal, wouldn't it? Bye. Brother. Well, brother, I'm back from Dallas. Me and Rhea. I had to bring her back. Faye hasn't got her apartment yet. I sure be glad if she hurry up and get one. I don't know, things seem to be a little better, but I don't know, I'd rather her have her apartment. The woman rented the apartment to another lady. 
So therefore she had to wait until the girl moved but I, she called Sunday night and said she was gonna move Monday with a girlfriend. I hope she got moved. But I don't know, Faye is so funny, she got she's so slow and everything. I guess when she get the other room, I hope she do with that lady so she can take the baby. It'll be nice for her to have her, let her have a little trouble with her too. I guess uh, when she, that girl moves then she'll take that apartment back. I guess the Barnett's will be down some weekend now since they didn't get to make it for Christmas. They all was sick. So I just came on back after New Year's. They couldn't bring me home. But otherwise, D got sick Monday night, so then I had to catch the bus. So I guess when they get all straightened out, maybe they'll come down some weekend. Oh yes, uh, Roosevelt had to go to the hospital last night. He had a poor muscle in his back, I think, and his hip or something. And Rosalie, she's sick again. She's got the flu, huh, and Rufus both. I just hope I don't get it. It's running around, though. I guess you'll sure enjoy this record when you hear <laughs> it's some mess. But all the voices and different sounds, I sound awful. I don't even sound like myself. Well, I guess I'll have to get used to it. I don't know hardly what to say. I have to write it down and then I'll forget it. <laughs> I like my watch. <laughs>